This is Twit. Now, we're going to help uh, our caller here in San Diego, Steve, because he's about to buy one of those beautiful new 5K IMAX. Uh, it's it's an interesting story. The, the screen is stunning. It's not 4K. It's 5K. Super high resolution. Looks great. Color, for a photographer, it's a dream come true. And really, Apple can only do it because it's built into the computer. They can't, in fact, that, that computer will not drive a 5K external display. It can only do it because it's not connected through Thunderbolt or DisplayPort. It's direct connected to the motherboard. They had their own special chipsets they designed to make this all work. And I have to tell you, I, I have one. It is stunning. But the problem is storage because it's an all-in-one computer, and so you really only have a couple of choices. You can't put two hard drives in there. Uh, actually, they do with a Fusion drive, but it's not exactly two big hard drives. They have one three-terabyte spinning drive and then a smaller 128-gigabyte SSD card on that drive. And the theory of the Fusion drive is you're going to get all of the capacity of a spinning drive. Th plenty! Three terabytes. That's a ton. But it'll be faster than a spinning drive because... Apple's operating system will watch what you do and copy the stuff you need the fastest and the most and you access, you read most often to the little SSD portion. And of course, that's going to be OS X probably. Uh, maybe if you load Lightroom a lot, it'll be Lightroom. And that does speed things up a little. But my experience with the Fusion Drive is it's nowhere near as fast as a full SSD. Well, the, you know, that was my question, uh, whether I would notice the difference between the two because... Um, it, it's interesting you'd said that the IMAX um, only have the uh, the big hard drive or the SSD drive, but I actually modified my previous iMac and, and did put an SSD drive in with my um, hard drive, and so I guess I got spoiled on that. Uh, it does make a difference, doesn't it? Running, running, put, just putting OS 10 in your apps on the SSD makes a huge difference. Boot times are speedier and everything. My experience with the Fusion Drive is not that fast. So the Fusion Drive does not um, load and, and hold the apps in the in the SSD portion of the. Uh, I'm sorry, not the it SSD, might. The, you don't know. It, you don't control it. Only uh, Apple. Yeah. Only Apple knows, and uh, it has its own magic, you know, algorithm for figuring out what to put on the speedy drive and what to put on the slower drive. One right. would assume that's going to be the operating system of the apps, but you don't control it. And there's no way you can control it. There's also issues. For instance, I, they may have fixed this, but for a while I couldn't run Windows on this machine because Windows doesn't have that fusion capability. It just sees two hard drives. It's also possible to accidentally unpair the drives, and then you're really, a, it's a mess. You have to rebuild everything. Yeah, and that's what I've been reading online is, is if you've got the choice to... I just I get the SSD. The fusion. Yeah. yeah. Now, if you're really w willing to spend money, that what I did is I got uh, on my Mac Pro, I got an internal, relatively small. You don't need a giant one because, as again, it's just going to hold the operating system and the apps. If you do decide to use Boot Camp and run Windows, it should be bigger. But uh, probably 128 is big enough. Certainly 256 is big enough for the internal drive. And then I got a little big disk, uh, which I love, um, and that is an external. Uh, Thunderbolt 2 drive. They're expensive. It's $12.99 for a terabyte. But it's it's just as fast as an internal drive. Right. And the only negative is, you know, you have this beautiful all-in-one computer and now you're hanging things off of it. Yeah. Yeah, but, uh, you know, with the amount of uh, storage that I need, I, I pretty much always have to be tethered to hard drives. Extra. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. Well, I think if speed is of the essence, and I think it is, I, I love it when stuff, you know, the Mac boots fast, everything happens fast, um, then I'd get an SSD. All right. All right. I'll do that. Yeah. Thanks for All the right. call. I appreciate it. Thanks, Leo.